We're back, fellow knife enthusiast. I'm C, and this is Jewel. Just can't set still, Jewel. There's a reason for that. We're giving you a shorter AK Blade episode this week because we'll be airing our spooktacular Halloween what? special for you guys tomorrow. And we wanted to put all of our energy into that. Along with our yak yak. And mother-in-law jabs. Psh. Well, okay, mm. some mother-in-law jabs. Better. Mm. So, we're hitting a new QSP folder this week. Best Tech Flipper and our Spyderco Limited Edition Damascus Delica and Endura 4 Zomaze. Can you say Zomaze plural? If I have a Zome and I get another Zome, do I have Zomaze? Yeah, I don't think it's like cold, cold it sex. Is Zome. It's Zome. No, it's Zome. So, I promise. Zome's I'll look it up. With an S? Zome. It's too much yak yak for this episode. Cacti, Let's no. move it on. Both of which I will accept as an early Christmas gift hmm. this year. Good one. So the QSP Leopard, guys, we're just gonna jump right in there. Comes in three different versions. Carbon fiber, black linen micarta, and green linen micarta. Surprisingly, we get the green one here. See, never uh, dishes out for the carbon fiber one. <laughs> it's got a 4.25 inch Sandvik 14C28N steel blade with a satin finish and jimping Though the cutting edge is probably more like three inches, just so you guys know. It operates on caged, wait, I'm sorry, they're not caged, they're ceramic ball bearings, because we have to be skipping out on the cage there. Mm. Thank goodness for that, you know. Ready for me to fill it in? Sure, go ahead. It's got a green linen micarta handle, built-in lanyard hole. Whoop, whoop. Blade is deployed through, you guessed it, jimped, squared, Flipper. Yep. Which I had there. to say, that works for me. I like it too. I mean, I feel like the handle could have been a bit bigger. Because when you're kind of holding it, it's it's a little small. I'm kind of hitting my hand. I'm holding it. Here you go. That. I don't that, know. I mean, I think it's a... It's a good three finger. Other than that, it's a good uh, QSP EDC edition. I like it. Oh, finally, this carry is 7.25 inches overall and has a tip-up stainless steel pocket clip and a recessed jimp backspacer. Can't be it. My, my backspacers, I want them to be recessed. recessed. Yep. Either recess it or don't do it. That's our motto. Yeah, we pretty much spend our day recessed. So, I would have to say that... Really best about this one? Well, I really like this folder, but... Here's going to be the problem. It's Sandvik 14C28. That's a problem. Well, see, it's good steel. Yeah. But everybody here is accustomed now to D2 being that quality steel. Mm, okay. When, like in Europe, that's your quality steel in the budget area. I guess. So, you. I don't know. I mean, I like it a lot. I would carry it. And how much is it? Well, I'm just about to tell you. I'll flip this sign and say 4888 at landknife.com. There it is. I mean, I too, I, I feel like this knife could be like a hit or a miss. I mean, people are either going to love it because it has Sandvik steel, or they're going to hate it because it has Sandvik steel. So. I don't think it, to use one of my old sayings, blows anyone's skirt up. Uh, because mm. like, Roik uses it, or Riak or Rack, or Riak or Roke. And they make some really good knives, and they're, and they're hardly ever returned for any issues, mm -hmm. and they're low-priced. And they just have a nice steady sales pace. Yeah, they don't have a they don't have a champion. They don't have a flagship, as someone I know would say. Mm. So, you know, kind of disappointing. But, but is it, I like it. Is it gonna sell though? It will gonna, sell. Yeah. People are gonna be like. Well, there are a lot of people now it? that are buying QSPs because they now have a penguin and a parrot, and realize, oh, this is nice. So. I don't know. I still feel like it's a love or hate. More likely a hate. I feel like. I don't think anything really stands out on it it's to draw its attention from the 9 million other knives in its class. Mm. But I would carry it. So. You carry it. Yep. Yeah. All right. So, 
Are you ready? Yeah, I set you up like six times for your next line, but not <laughs> once. Just like jump in and use it. Our so. next knife is the Best Tech Penguin. So you just... And look, I got all three. What? Or is, or is there four? Have you seen our <laughs> penguins? <laughs> you people know what I'm talking about. Just We've got plenty, just like thingamabobs. So this flipper is 8.47 inch overall with mm -hmm. a 3.6 D2 steel yes. blade. Yes. With a stone wash and satin finish, which operates on... Say, say it together now. There it is. Caged, caged ceramic, ceramic ball, ball bearings. bearings. There we go. Yep. If you don't okay. cage your bearings, then what do you have? Mm. Chaos. And it's deployed through the jimped flipper. Mm -hmm. It's about three and a half millimeters thick, and the whole shebang weighs in at about 4.9 ounce. So the handle is G10. <clears throat> it's offered in the orange and black. Perfect for Halloween. Mm -hmm. The blue and black. And finally, the green and black. <gasps> yes, and it goes just nicely with my jacket. What? It's another good uh, good gift here. All right. So, mm -hmm. I already know what you're going to say. You're going to say that you like the look of the knife because of the dual colored handles. And it reminds me of the swordfish. However, Perfect match you're not a huge fan. Because, how should I put it, you think they're copycats by yes. stealing the name Penguin. Yep, yep. I mean, although I like, you know, because imitation is supposed to be the finest form of flattery, I don't think it's best text color, to be perfectly honest. I, I love so many of their knives. I mean, I'm obsessed with their malware, you guys know that. I just think they could have aimed a little higher and called it something else. No, I disagree. I know you would. Yep. I think it was smart marketing to move on the Penguin. Mm -hmm. It's 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 QSP and we're selling out like hotcakes. Then why not jump on that, uh, you know, the penguin as well? You know, get some traffic to head down your road. You know, that's, that's what I'm saying. Mm -hmm. I, okay, I guess I can understand. I can give them credit where credit is due. You know, mm -hmm. smart move, best tech, but doesn't mean I have to like it. However. However, there is something I do like. Which is? Landknife.com. Aha! Uh -huh. And their is. giveaways. That's true. Yeah. I like so this if you guys make sure to like, share, comment, and subscribe, you will be entered to win the Civivi Ortiz. Mm hmm. A new knife model that we uh, did in our last AK Blade episode. So. If you want specs, check out the corner. I'm not sure which one, so I just pointed to both. And it could have been down there. No. Four way corner. <clears throat> And on Atlantic Knife's blog, we are giving away the... Did you hear that? Yes, I heard that. You know what? They heard that three blocks down the road at the carpet store. Wow. Limited edition, Spyderco. Is this an Endura? Yes, Endura. What? You had the question? I had it in my hand. I couldn't see the blade. Uh-huh. Where was I at? You, you so rudely interrupted me. I'm sorry. Spyderco, Endura, limited edition, Damascus blade to four. So make sure to answer that question on the AK blog to be entered. Luckily for you guys, you're going to get an up and close view of close it. Close and personal because it's the next knife on the table what? along with the Delica, which comes in a similar fashion. Cha-ching. I'm going to start with the Endura 4. I'll just play with the Delica. Since it's C's favorite and one we're giving away. Yes. Fine by me. Great. So this lockback is approximately nine and a half inches overall with a four inch Damascus steel blade, sporting some jimp in there. The blade is deployed through the Spider Cove's iconic thumb hole, so Jewel will be thumb holing it. Thumb opening. While the Zome FRN, which stands for fiberglass, fiberglass reinforced, reinforced nylon, nylon, handles allow for multiple four-way pocket clip positions. Why did you have to work it in Tip there? up, tip down, we took left it out and right. For a reason. All right. And you still... And, and where can you get this knife? It's available at landknife.com. Yep. Just 119 for the Endura 4 and 112 for the Delica. So... Make sure you're not too hot over there. Mm-hmm. All right. The Delica, on the I'm other sure hand... You try, but I don't think it'll help. <laughs> okay, Yeah, I ahead. tried to sweep her away, too. It's just a little over 7 inches. Is that correct? Mm -hmm. I think I know the Delica. With a 3-inch Damascus steel blade... The handle is Zome FRN, which stands for Fiberglass Reinforced, Reinforced Nylon. Nylon. It too has the pocket clip. You can 
position multiple ways. Why do you need to say it like that? I have you no clue. You don't need to say it like that. And I often wonder, though, with these, that you can put the pocket clip in all four positions on the handle. Does somebody buy four of the knives just so they can have it? You know, one tip up, one tip down, right and left. I'm going to say no. Why? Because people don't spend large amounts of money on stupid things like that. Oh, yeah, you know what? You're right. People <laughs> save their money, invest in Bitcoin, and don't even spend their money on expensive things like Lord of the Ring Gandalf staffs or <sighs> silver or guns. I could keep going. I mean, Wait a minute. Not. Are you really comparing a Spyderco Endura 4 to guns? Or as we like to call them, weapons? Oh, that's how everyone else likes to call them. Mm -hmm. These are investments, okay? As long as you don't mess them up. Or they're completely unrecognizable these are investments like using it for a non knife like task like turning a screw or opening a can of paint i don't know why you bring that up right now but yes things like that sure if you can refrain from doing any of that they're yours mm -hmm. and you can sell them for more than what you bought them for bam best in spider co over time from landknife.com the best advice not given by jewel so what was your favorite what was my favorite it is a tough call Okay, I know there's only a few folders this week. I like the mass of Spider Co. However, I am not a huge fan of... You don't want to thumbhole it? <sighs> I don't know. There's only uh, three on the uh, table. And so. I, liked the, I liked the smooth opening of the QSP. Ching. I mean, it's really quick and fast. I like that. Yep. But the handle was just a little too small for me. Okay. And the best heck, its name does irk me a little. But I think it's going to have to be best tech. Really? Yes. Who's my favorite member of NSYNC? Justin. Who's my favorite Backstreet Boy? <laughs> nice try, NSYNC forever. Damn it! <laughs> yep. And we already know you're Spartaco all the way, so. Yep. What about you guys? What was your favorite of the week? Why would you ask them that? We already know what they're going to say. We, you know what you're going to, you, we know. They're, we know what they're going to say. Well, I know which one's going to sell the best. <laughs> it's going to be this one. Is it? Yeah, because these are limited. <laughs> And uh, the, the swordfish. Yeah, but you still blue know, and black sold tons. Oh, you still the they do look very similar. The swordfish and the penguin, it's just mm -hmm. slightly larger. But you already know they're gonna they're gonna go spider co spider co every time. That's what they're gonna say. Yeah. Uh huh. But that vindicates my choice much better. But if I see it in writing, you know, just like a contract doesn't matter unless it's in writing. Mm. I've heard a uh, word is stronger than oak. <laughs> What happened to your word is stronger than oak. <laughs> wow. Show me the money. Uh, All right. Speaking of contracts, you know, mother-in-law closed no. on her house, right? Did she? Mm -hmm. Wow. She closed on her house. Does that mean she moved out? Nope. 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 Wow. Got renovations to you do. You should have known that. We'll get into that another time. Oh, renovations. Don't forget. Hell yeah. Just. Don't forget to like, share, comment, and subscribe. Catch us on Instagram. That way, you're always hand in hand. We're also on social media sites like Facebook, With Atlantic Pinterest, Night. Reddit, YouTube, and Instagram. Yeah, I don't see that on there anywhere. Yeah, I know. Hmm. Ready to witness whatever new surprises we happen to carve oh, up. Good pun. Like our Halloween special, which will air tomorrow. So make sure you tune in for that. It's going to be... Do I really have to say it? No, I'll say it. Scary good fun. With that. I'm C, and this is Joel. Just Joel, and we are signing off.